God was with his people as they entered the Promised Land. Joshua and the Israelites had defeated the cities of Jericho and Ai. They made peace with their neighbors, the people of Gibeon. One day, the Israelites came to a place ruled by five kings. The kings did not love God or worship him. They had heard about God's people and were afraid. One king called to the other four kings in the land. He said to them, help me attack Gibeon because it has made peace with Joshua and the people of Israel. So the five kings joined forces and went up with all their armies to fight against Gibeon. The men of Gibeon sent a message to Joshua, help us, save us, all the kings who live in this land are fighting against us. So Joshua and his whole army went to Gibeon to help them. The Lord said to Joshua, do not be afraid of the kings, for I have handed them over to you. Not one of them will be able to stand against you. Joshua and his army marched all night from where they were staying, and they surprised the five kings' armies. As the Israelites fought, God confused the kings' armies and helped Israel defeat their enemies. The five kings' armies fled. The Lord sent hail from the sky to stop them. The battle was not over. Joshua needed more time to fight before the sun went down. So Joshua prayed to God, sun stand still over Gibeon and moon over the valley. The sun stood still and the moon stopped until Israel and Gibeon defeated the kings. The sun did not set for almost a full day. There has been no day like it before or since. As the Israelites traveled in the promised land, they took over many other cities. God fought for his people and helped Joshua and the Israelites conquer the land God had promised to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. God gave the Israelites peace and rest from their enemies for many years. When Joshua was old, he reminded the Israelites about all the great things God had done for them. The people said, we will worship the Lord because he is our God. Then Joshua died. Joshua's name means the Lord is salvation. God fought for Joshua and the Israelites, saving them and giving them victory over their enemies. Sinners can look to God for victory over sin and death. God brought us salvation by sending his son, Jesus, to die on the cross and rise again.